Renewal by Anderson of Central Pennsylvania sponsors this podcast and it's having a promotion right now that's so good it's scary. Buy one window or door and get another window or door at 40% off. Ooh, plus another $250 off your whole project. That's at no money down, no payments, and no interest for a whole year. Check out RenewalByAnderson.com to learn more. A school's under scrutiny for planning to install bathroom surveillance windows. Meanwhile, UPMC is planning to buy urgent cares. A few parks are getting some upgrades. Lastly, another pizza accolade for Pennsylvania. I'm Claudia DeMiro, and you're listening to Today in PA. The Southwestern School District in York County is planning to install windows in its gender-inclusive bathrooms, allowing for people to look inside, reports PennLive. The school board ordered this $8,700 installation so students using it can be surveilled, but only in the public areas of the bathroom, i.e. those outside of stalls. Additionally, privacy will be added to stalls too, so there's no view into them. Board President Matthew Gelazila explained to PennLive via email that the purpose of these windows was so that employees would be able to better monitor kids for prohibited activities like vaping or bullying. Critics, however, are accusing the school of invading kids' privacy. It's also, according to them, a concerted effort to monitor and intimidate LGBTQ students. Southwestern has previously been the topic of conversation in such issues in its other policies, like when it passed a measure earlier this year that requires teachers to inform parents if their child has requested to call themselves by a different name or pronoun. UPMC is looking to take over a number of MedExpress urgent cares next year, reports WPXI. The Health Network revealed a new joint venture with Go Health Urgent Care this week, detailing its plan to operate former MedExpress locations as UPMC Go Health Urgent Care instead. The exact number of MedExpresses this will affect hasn't been confirmed as of yet, but this transition does apply to locations in West Virginia and Virginia as well as Pennsylvania. It was September 2022 when the State Department of Conservation and Natural Resources announced the creation of three new state parks, Susquehanna Riverlands in York County, Big L Creek in Chester County, and Vosburgh Neck in Wyoming County, states the York Daily Record. Now, after assessing each, officials have worked on a plan to make a few upgrades and improvements to them with regards to public use and protecting resources. This includes possibly renaming Susquehanna Riverlands, as that one's already been used by other organizations and entities, and making some tweaks to trails. Pennsylvania has been previously recognized as the number one best state for pizza and for being home to one of the best pizzerias in the world, says PennLive. Now it's received yet another pizza accolade. The Keystone State, according to pizza oven company Gosney, is home to one of the U.S.'s top pizza capitals. Philadelphia, as it's the fourth most pie-obsessed in the country. In first was New York, which, instead of the Big Apple, should be called the Big Cheese in this regard. Happy Friday! To keep yourself up to date over the weekend, visit penlive.com, and please don't forget to rate this podcast and to share it around with your family and friends, maybe even a foe. Thanks ahead of time, and as always, thanks for sticking with us. I'm Claudia DeMiro, and we'll reconvene next week for some more Today in PA. Renewal by Anderson of Central Pennsylvania sponsors this podcast, and it's having a promotion right now that's so good, it's scary. Buy one window or door, and get another window or door at 40% off. Ooh, plus another $250 off your whole project. That's at no money down, no payments, and no interest for a whole year. Check out RenewalByAnderson.com to learn more.